what's going on guys this is Zach from Rooted Expeditions and I want to tell you guys to never give up ever I just want to stop and thank everybody for y'all's support. Y'all have been amazing. I want to give a shout out to my 500 subscribers. Uh, I thank y'all. And also I want to shout out to my 600 subscribers. Show my appreciation and take a moment and to thank my 800 subscribers. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Just want to say, Thank you for 2,000 subs. I, I'm just, I, it's another milestone. I'm super happy. But I do just want to stop and just say thank you to each and every one of you guys for hitting that 2,000 uh, subscriber milestone. So, um, yeah, I just, I, it, it, it's just, I'm lost for words. I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys for all of those that are constantly watching, constantly commenting. I, I consider you guys family. I really do. You're, you're like family to me and Carrie and just the love and the support that you give is it, just, it's phenomenal. And I just, again, I'm so blessed and so thankful to have each and every one of you guys. It truly means a lot. It really, really does. I just want to say, don't give up. I don't know what you're going through. Don't give up. When you're down and out and you don't think there's a way out, just know God is worthy. Just know God is good. Stay motivated. Stay blessed. And you know what? I challenge you today to do something nice for somebody. And then on top of that, someone that you don't even know. Be a light. Know that you are loved. You are loved by God. It doesn't matter if anybody, if ever everybody hates you in this world, as long as God is on your side, that's all that matters. And I want to let you know that God loves you. No matter what you've been through, no matter what you've done, God loves you. What's going on fam? It's Zach from Rooted Expeditions. I just want to sit here and encourage you with positivity. I want you to take every negative thing that has been put into your life, every negative thing that has, uh, that someone has said to you, I want you to throw that away right now. I want you to discard that and I want you to replace all of those negativity. I want you to replace that with all the positivity. If someone says, oh, you ain't going to make it, I want you to turn around and say, no, I am going to make it. When somebody says, oh, well, you look sad, say, no, I'm, I'm just happy. When somebody wants to sit here and say, well, you just need to quit, say, no, I'm going to keep pushing forward. Just keep doing you. Do what you love to do. Start spreading the good news, the positivity in your life and around you. Be that light. As you walk into the room, be that presence that everybody sees, oh, well, here comes some positivity. So erase all that negativity that, has, that somebody has said to you or that is going on in your life. Erase it all and replace it with that positive, good, peaceful mindset. 
So, man, I had a little bit about myself. I had, I didn't have, I, I chose to take a bad path. I chose to put myself into a negative situation every single day. I could have chose the good stuff. I could have stayed positive and moved forward. But I, I was selfish. I was self-centered. All I cared about was myself. I never cared about anybody else. Um, and it didn't do any good for me. I never thought about anybody else. I didn't care about anybody else. I always cared about how I was going to be that day. What was going to make me happy that day. And it didn't get me anywhere. It really didn't. Uh, I've, I've fallen on hard times many times. Times where I actually had to uh, sleep in my car. Uh, I didn't have a home. Um, but this, this, this is was decisions that I had made. Um, I, I made a lot of poor choices in my life. Uh, and I made some good choices too. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to discount those, but you you make your destiny, you 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 make your your fate, you choose that, whether it's going to be the right way or you're going to fight against the current and go the wrong way. Um, yeah, I just I made I made some really poor choices in my life, and but the the thing is is how I can look at this in a positive way is that I wouldn't be who I am today if I didn't go through the heartache and the trials and tribulations that I went through back back then. I wouldn't be the person I am today. I wouldn't be as strong as I am uh, today. I wouldn't. I'd be probably weaker. I mean, there's no telling what I would be. But the thing is, is that I, I just... From, from my experience and what I've been through, now I know everybody's walk is different. I know that everybody's journey is different. I, I understand that. But there is a difference between taking the wrong path and the right path. There is a big difference. I know sometimes we can't see what's going on right in front of us. But uh, I just wanna say breathe. Take a second to yourself, step back and look at the bigger picture. Don't let the things of this world affect you. Don't let things um, that people say affect you. Words are just words, and they can be very dangerous, but you can't let that get to you. Don't let somebody else's anger or somebody else's negativity affect you and your positivity. Don't let that happen. Keep moving forward. Keep staying positive. Even through a negative situation, you lost your job. Well, look at it like this. Don't be sitting there and being self-doubt, self-pity, or, or sadness. Don't be like, well, I lost my job. I, I just don't know what I'm going to do. No, be like, I lost my job maybe because it was for a reason. It's for a reason so I can be a better person. So I can move forward and get a better job and, 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 and see a better me. Just look at it like that. There's two ways you can look at it. You can look at things two different ways. You can look at it in a negative mindset or you can look at it in a positive mindset. Like I said, for example, you lose your job, you can be in self-pity. Well, ah, oh, man, screw those people for firing me or for letting me go. Uh, they could have let that other person go, but they decided to let me go. Uh, no, don't look at it like that. Be like, well, maybe it was for a reason. That's the positive mindset. Maybe it was for a reason. Why? Why is it for a reason? Maybe because I can get a better job. Maybe I can, I can do something better and, and, and get a better job for myself so I, I can provide for my family. You know? Or maybe, maybe, maybe look at it like this. Oh, well, I, I'm just not making as much money as I used to. I'm just never going to make it. I'm not I'm never going to make it. Well, maybe think about it like this. Maybe God's, maybe God's humbling you. Think about that. These are things that I think on a daily basis. Every time I get put in a negative situation, I have to step back. Do I get into my flesh and sit here and get angry and frustrated? Of course, everybody does. 
But the thing is, is that we got to look at things in a positive mindset. Because if we're in a positive and peaceful mindset and we have patience and things that are going on, we can think clear. And when we can think clear, we can move forward without stumbling. That's the thing. So, guys, I just want you to stay motivated. I want you, I challenge you to take something that is going negative in your life and turn it around to make something positive out of it, whatever that might be. If it's your relationship, your marriage, or your job, or finances, or where you stay. Yeah, this message is for you. To take that negative and turn it into a positive. And you're like, well, how do I do that? Well, start thinking positive. The opposite of what you're thinking as negative, turn that into a positive. Start making good out of things. Well, I don't have a job. Now I can do this. It doesn't matter if you're getting paid or not. At least you're moving forward, moving, doing something that's positive, doing something that's good. I tell you, you sow into somebody else's life, and the more you harvest, you're going to reap from that. The more you the more you sow into things, the more you're going to harvest out of it, the more you're going to reap from it. So, guys, stay positive and always move forward. Look at the brighter side of things. Remember this. If you can take anything out of this message today, I want to sit here and tell you, it is never always going to be green grass and blue skies. There's going to be muddy grounds and it's going to be raining and cloudy outside. Is that are you going to flop there in the mud and lay down and quit? Or are you going to fight through that mud and keep moving forward until you get to that green grass again? So, all right, guys, I hope that y'all have a blessed and wonderful day. So, peace. I love you. And always, God bless.